let's talk about risk. The chance of injury, damage, or loss, dangerous chance, hazard. So, I don't take risk, ever. Well, not, none that matter anyway. I only take calculated risks, to the point that they're no longer risks at all. I don't ask the cute girl for her number. I don't go to the sketchy part of town. I don't leave my stuff unattended. I don't even go to parks after dark. I don't take risks. Unless I'm sure there's no risk at all, I don't go for it. That is, until recently, and I was terrified. I've been doing, you know, self-portraits and portraits and product photography, and I was happy, I was, it was fine, like it was, it was okay. But then it just came to a point where I wasn't happy anymore, and I wasn't sure what to do. I, I, I really didn't know what to do, or where to go next, or if I even wanted to take photography. So uh, I looked at all the people I follow, and all the photographers that I enjoy, and I noticed one thing that was common about most of them. And that was, that was, they were all night photographers. So, I got to thinking. I was thinking, what if I could be a night photographer? I mean, I just bought a really nice new tripod, and I have a camera, and I've done night photography before, and I liked it. So, why not make the switch? And that switch was the risk and it paid off. I've been much more motivated. I've taken so many more photos, and I'm currently going out to take photos right now. Like, I've become so much happier and created a lot more since I made the switch. So, this was a good risk.